There are just some days that when you wake up, you know without a shadow of a doubt that it's going to be a busy day. Today, my friends, is one of those days. The weather outside is so crappy. It is cold and it is raining. It is not fun time for a busy day. So like I said, I have a really busy day. This morning I worked from eight to 11 and then, uh, and now I had to run back home because this one is leaving me again. <laughs> so I'm taking her to the airport. She's going back to New York again. And then she'll be there in like two more weeks again. So I gotta take her to the airport. So we're gonna go do that now. Just dropped off Kelly at the airport. Uh, she'll be there for two days, so not too bad. Um, and now I am headed to a meeting. So I do contract work with my old job. And so I have to meet with him, them on an upcoming project that I'm starting this week. Something I was gonna mention real quick, uh, kind of a quick tip, keep like a quest bar or something with you at all times because you never know when you're gonna be on the go. Like for me, my meeting is at noon, so I'm gonna have to wait until after my meeting to eat, so this will hold me over until then. Um, so yeah, always keep like a bar or something with you, so that way you're not caught in a situation where you're starving, so when the, by the time you get food, you just like chow down and pig out. Just finished up with my meeting, and that actually was a lot quicker than I expected, which is always good, so it did not take me as long as I thought it would. Uh, now I'm gonna go pick up lunch. I think I'm gonna go to Chick-fil-A. Uh, they have grilled nuggets, so since I'm gluten-free, it's kind of hard to eat uh, to eat out. Sometimes it's, it's a little bit challenging, so I'm gonna go do that, gotta get gas, and then head back to my job. Just got back to work. Uh, I did end up going to Chick-fil-A and getting the, uh, the grilled chicken nuggets. Um, they're just easier to eat in the car and they're gluten-free so that makes life very simple um, I did calculate them in my fitness pal and got all of that together My lunch is, was a little bit higher in calories than normal, but my breakfast was also lower so um, and then sometimes when you're out and about like if you Can kind of plan ahead and plan your meals ahead of time then you can plan for um, having to eat out and on the go. So I'm gonna head back into work. I'll see you guys after. Have you ever had an idea that just like burned in your brain? Like you had to do something about it. Like whether it was an idea to create something or to do something that you just had to act on this idea. Otherwise it was just gonna continue to bug you. So I've had this idea for probably like a good month or two. And I finally decided to act on it and I'm so excited that it's finally here and I can show you guys this idea. So here is my idea. The ARRW basically says arrow without the, without the O. In the whole concept of an arrow, it kind of represents life. In order for an arrow to shoot forward, it has to be pulled back and sometimes pulled back so there's so much tension you really think the bow's gonna break, but it won't. So in order for an arrow to be projected forward, it has to be pulled back. The same concept goes for your journey and just life in general. Sometimes things happen to where you're pulled back and you think you can't take it anymore, but sometimes you're pulled back just enough so that you're projected into greatness. You're projected into something awesome. So that's the front of the shirt. Let me show you guys the back of the shirt. So this is the back of the shirt. If you follow me on Instagram, I am always posting this. This is my personal mantra. Keep going, keep pushing, keep believing. It's something that I say to myself all the time. And honestly, that mantra helped me run a mile, like a mile without stopping a few months ago. Um, it's just something that I truly believe like no matter what you got to keep going You have to keep pushing yourself and you have to keep believing in yourself because ultimately when it all comes down to it It's you versus you. So I am so excited about this shirt. I can't wait to start rocking it. Good day guys. Good day headed to the gym Rocking my new shirt. I have to say guys. I am like so stoked. Like I have not been this excited about something in quite a while. Like this shirt was an idea that I had for like months. Like I created this arrow logo months ago and it just kind of just like this idea sat in my head and I knew that I had to bring it to real life. Otherwise it would just still sit 
and my head and eat at me. So I'm very excited, very happy with the shirt. Cannot wait to continue to rock the shirt around. Um, but now I am headed to the gym. I'm gonna give it another try. Last time I tried it, it was like terrible. It was very crowded, super annoying. Um, but I'm gonna try to go and get an upper workout, in, upper body workout in. So we will see what happens. Quick 35 minutes in the gym, chest and back. It was good to be back in the gym, good to be back lifting. I felt like I got a nice pump in my muscles. Um, and now I'm headed to yoga. The one thing I really like about yoga is that I feel like when you are in that hot room and you're sweating a lot, I don't know, it's just like almost like a cleanse and it just feels amazing and awesome. Class was uh, challenging, but I feel like in the short time that I've been doing yoga, I'm getting better at it. My balance is getting better um, and I'm able to kind of flow through things a little bit better. So. Now uh, it's about nine o'clock, so I'm gonna head home, eat dinner. Um, I've got my Q&A, which you will see before this video. I got that to record and edit and get uploaded. And then I've got a lot of other stuff to do. So I said in the beginning of this day that it was a busy, busy day. And I feel like one of the things that I wanna leave you guys with is, if you have goals, if you have goals that you want to reach and you want to obtain and you have dreams and desires, um, you just have to do it. And, and there's 24 hours in a day, so you just have to like figure out the best way to utilize those 24 hours. So um, yeah, I you know, it's crazy because I, I have a full-time job, I'm married, I do YouTube, I have a contract job, I work out, you know, like I have a lot going on and a lot on my plate, but at the end of the day, like I'm happy because I'm doing the things that I love and I'm doing things that will help me reach my ultimate goals. So uh, that's what I want to leave you guys with. So that's going to be it guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I truly, truly appreciate it. If you liked the video, hit that thumbs up button. If you don't subscribe, please subscribe. I have videos coming out every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and I will answer every single one of them. Thank you guys. Talk to you guys later.